Hey guys, so I did a, this makeup look for you today. It's actually going to be, it's my birthday at midnight tonight, so I have to work. So I wanted to do something a little bit dramatic with my makeup, because that's pretty much the only way I guess I can get to celebrate today. But anyways, it's just like a, um, a bright blue with some dramatic eyeliner and all that fun stuff. But um, if you'd like to see how I did it, then keep on watching. I'm going to start by priming my eye with my Urban Decay Primer Potion. If you're wondering why it's in this, you can check out my How to Depot Your Urban Decay Primer Potion video. I'll put a link somewhere around here. Anyway, I'm just going to apply a little bit of that to my eye. So I'm going to take a little bit right underneath my lash line since I'm going to be applying a colored liner there. I'm going to kind of be working backwards today. I'm going to start by lining my upper and lower water lines with my um, Total Prestige liner. It's just a cre any creamy black pencil will do. I'm just going to line your upper and lower water lines with this. Take it all the way in to your inner corner. Take texture, eyeshadow, or any medium brown. I'm going to be using my Coastal Scents Deluxe Crease Brush. We're going to start from the outer corner and do a windshield wiper motion in. This will set the boundary to where our eyeshadows will be placed. I'm going to take my Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk. Get a little bit on my finger like this and place this just underneath where we place the brown shadow. If you don't feel comfortable placing the jumbo pencil on after your shadow, you can do this before you place the brown shadow on. It's completely up to you. Now take any bright blue color that you have. I'm going to use my Urban Decay palette. This color is shattered. Looks like this. I'm going to take a large brush. This is the MAC 252, just a really big eyeshadow brush. We're going to place this on the outer half of the lid. Underneath where we applied the brown. Taking a flat shader brush, I'm going to use my NYX White Pearl Shadow. This is a shimmery white, so take just take any shimmery white shadow you have. Place this on the inner half of the eye in a patting motion because if you if you're using this this is really chalky so you don't want a lot of fallout you want to kind of bring this over into the blue and just pat over to blend we're also going to bring this into the inner tear duct the next color I'm going to use is going to be Brown Down by MAC. It's just a really deep brown, so use any deep brown shadow you have. I'm going to use the MAC 224, but take any fluffy crease brush that you have. We're just going to place this on the outer corner to help blend out the harsh line of, that the blue created and also give a little bit of dimension. My voice sounds really boring today. Sorry guys. <laughs> Whatever. Next, I'm going to use my um, Victoria's Secret Very Sexy Sparkling Eyeliner. This is a glitter eyeliner. Um, it's The color is Lilac Flash. I don't think that they still carry these anymore. I'm not sure they may, but just take any purple eyeliner that you have, just kind of like a, a violet color. Looks like this. And we're going to go and line the lower lashes. We've already lined our waterline, so we're going to go right underneath that and smudge this into the lashes.
The last thing we want to do is line the upper lash line, and I'm going to be using the um, Maybelline Waterproof Ultra Liner. We're going to be doing pretty dramatic liner. When you get to the outer corner, wing it out. Then starting where the tip of that wing ends, draw, extend the line slightly. And create a larger wing. This doesn't have to be perfect because we're going to add a black shadow over it. So there we have kind of a rough drawing of our liner. And when I say rough, I mean rough. <laughs> then we're going to correct any mistakes that we made using the NYX black shadow. For cheeks, I'm just going to use my um, Mineralized Blush in Gleeful. It's just a pretty pink blush. Just going to dab that right on the apples of my cheeks. And then for lipstick, I'm going to use um, Modesty by MAC. It's kind of like a muted pink. I just want to keep everything fairly neutral to keep the focus on the eyes. And that pretty much does it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you next time. Bye.